Hey guys, today we are going to be changing out the standard, um, I don't know if you want to call it entertainment center, catch-all area, what you want to call it, um, in your camper. Um, we're going to be changing that out, taking it out, and actually installing a fireplace with, you know, nicer looking storage, and uh, the uh, we'll be able to move the TV down and center it up a little bit better, but then we'll have also have the electric heat off the fireplace, but uh, just... That is today's project. Um, we'll start clearing all this out and get a bare wall and then uh, then I'll come back and, and video from there and just keep you in steps. Like I said, this is for our, you know, our Wednesday videos. We're going to keep short. Um, I recommend you ask questions. If you've got questions, leave them in the comments. Be more than, more than happy to answer them. So just uh, send those in and we'll see what we can come up with for you guys. And I'll just take pictures as we go. So we'll talk to you a little bit. Okay guys, we got the old cabinets out, so the wall is clear. The fireplace cabinet and fireplace will actually go underneath the TV, so I'm just leaving it in place right now. You know, we're most likely going to be moving it down the wall, um, the TV itself down the wall, but I'm not going to wait till I get everything in here first. So I'm going to go out and start unboxing the fireplace and check it out and get ready to start putting it in and uh, yeah so we're gonna uh, the game plan on this is to turn around and the 15 and a half inch deep cabinet is going to become 12 inches deep by the time I get done I'm going to take three and a half to three and a quarter inches off the back of it to get it to, to fit in as far as depth wise goes with the slide but you'll see how I'm going to do all that I'll show you everything and then that way you've got it and uh, if you ever need to do it you can do it okay this is the unit we got it uh, is the dimensions on it are 48 inches wide by 15 and a half inches deep by I think it was 33 inches tall so it should fit in there really nice give us storage and then also give us the um, heat from the electric fireplace that is kind of nice on cool mornings just to knock it off you know just knock the chill off in the in the camper but uh, I will go through and do an unboxing of it, show you how everything is, and go from there.
so this is what we actually ended up with we uh, went in and I cut the wall and I can get down here and show you what I did I cut the wall the shape of the fireplace and it actually worked out really well because it went in nice and tight in these walls ours were actually two by two studs so what I did is I actually framed around all of this with two by two studs so that way I could secure it from inside and not have it move when we're going down the road the uh, the other thing that I actually did is um, in the where the TV was at or we put the TV at we turned around and I put more bracketry behind it too let me get some better light on this but uh, I put bracketry behind it also and move the TV over um, the fireplace we're really pleased with it it's really nice heat the uh, what I ended up doing was the plugs on the sides I got a heavy heavy multi plug that uh, I knew could handle it it actually does 1800 and some odd watts which the fireplace is only 15 max when it's on when it's on high so I knew it would handle that so it cleaned up the it cleaned up the cords down the sides I can actually I'm going to tie off the rest of those wires um, and get all that taken care of